Download this code from codegive.com, link in the description below. As of my last knowledge update in October 2023, Nezer Script Executor does not exist as a widely recognized or documented tool in the coding community. It's possible that it is a fictional or newly developed script executor that emerged after my training data. However, I can provide you with a general tutorial on how script executors work, particularly in the context of Roblox scripting or similar environments. Script executors are commonly used in game development and scripting to run code snippets or scripts within a game engine or platform. Here's a general guide that can help you understand how script executors function. What is a script executor? A script executor is a tool that allows users to run scripts, often written in languages like Lua, JavaScript, or Python, within a specific environment, such as a game or application. These tools are frequently used in the context of game modding, automation, and testing. How to use a script executor 1. Download and install the script executor Ensure you download the executor from a trusted source to avoid malware or malicious scripts. Install the executor by following the provided instructions. 2. Open the executor Launch the script executor after installation. 3. Attach to the game slash environment most executors require you to attach to the game or application you want to run scripts in. Look for an attach button in the interface. 4. Input your script. You will typically find a text box or code area where you can paste or write your script. 5. Execute the script. Once your script is ready, click on the execute button to run it. Example code snippet. Here's an example of a Lua script you might use in a game like Roblox. This script changes the player's character color. Explanation of the code Local player, this refers to the player currently using the script. Character, this is the player's in-game character model. Get children, this function retrieves all parts of the character. Isa, base part this checks if the object is a base part, like limbs. Brick color dot random, this function assigns a random color to each part. Important notes. Scripting ethics, always respect the terms of service of games and applications. Using script executors to exploit, hack, or cheat in games can lead to bans or other penalties. Learning scripting, if you are interested in scripting, Consider learning the programming language relevant to the environment, like Lua for Roblox, and practice writing scripts in a safe and ethical manner. Conclusion While I cannot provide specific details about the Nezer Script Executor 2025, the above general guide should help you understand how a script executor works and how to write a simple script. Always ensure you are using such tools ethically and within the guidelines set by the platform you are working on. If you have specific information about Nezer or need help with another topic, feel free to ask.